Demir's One, TD4 crew. We're here live at Five Points. Long Island City, New York. Freezing, you know, it is what it is. Welcome to our swimming pool. Lifeguard off duty. We'll be open later. Five Points is the only legal aerosol outlet in New York City. It is 200,000 square feet, one city block, five industrial floors. At any given time, there's between 350 to 400 pieces on the entire building, which is covered top to bottom. Pretty much anyone from the non-talented to the very talented could come, put up a piece on the walls, get a photo, and not have to worry about looking over their back. We get artists from not only all over the world, but all over New York and all over the United States that come here. Some of the pioneers, some, some that I looked up to when I was a young buck. Basically, a writer will contact me in advance and then I'll uh, tell them just when they get in to give me a buzz. That's just so that we could uh, place people accordingly. I want the people that deserve a really good spot to get that spot. I try to be as fair as possible. I don't want to, you know, use favoritism so that some people don't enjoy their stay here. We're pretty, uh, pretty diplomatic. One good thing about Five Points to me is that it kind of conveys that like pure essence of hip hop. Any given day, you could either see a piece being done, you could see MCs getting down in ciphers, you know, just for the hell of it. You could see break dancers getting down. And I think that's cool. I think that's what, what gives it such a, a fresh feel that you can't really get anywhere else in New York City. The content of graffiti art and the size and the scale of our canvases, our walls, is something that no museum could give you. I came in in 2002 and managed to cover up the entire building. By covering the building, it, it kind of brought the awareness of that building to a whole nother level. The one thing special is as the train comes up and above out of the ground, uh, Five Points is pretty much the first thing it sees and comes around the bend and gets like a full 360 view of the uh, building. It's like you're watching a movie that doesn't move. People that take the train that might have noticed it now I have no choice to notice it, it's, it's in your face. It's clearly the epicenter for New York Graph.